Hi, it's Alex. I want to talk about something that is going on a lot on the internet. There are all these websites out there that provide all these analytics, like tools that count numerical data. So for example, there is Google Analytics, which can measure the number of visits to a website. And if you look on YouTube, uh, YouTube tracks the number of views on a video, and it tracks the number of subscribers to a channel. And on Facebook and Twitter and all these sites, you have all these numbers. Like you can see, oh, this person has this many Twitter followers, and this person shared this thing on Facebook, and it has so and so many likes. And I think all these numbers can be kind of dangerously misleading, because I notice this tendency in myself. When I start sharing things online, I often start focusing on these numbers in a way that's kind of unhealthy. Like I'll share something, and it'll get a whole bunch of numerical attention, like a lot of people will like the post, and then I'll get really encouraged, I'm like, oh this is really great, like, uh, people must really like this material, and then I'll make another post, and no one will like it, and I start feeling really bad, I start feeling discouraged, I'm like, why don't people like this? And I don't necessarily think that this is the most healthy way of thinking about it. Like, these numbers don't really tell us anything very deep about what's going on. Like, if I look at my data and I see that a hundred people have viewed a website, I don't know what those people were thinking when they viewed that website. I don't know how it's impacted them. They might have read it and they might have not understood it very well, or maybe they just read part of it, or maybe they just went to the page because there was something specific on it and they didn't read much of the page at all. I don't really know what's going on. And I think when I think about it more deeply, the numbers don't really matter to me. Like what matters to me is achieving change in the world, like bringing good things into being in the world. So for example, if I write an article about depression, I don't really care if a thousand people view it if it doesn't actually help anybody. If only one person views that article and it helps that person to overcome their depression, or if it helps them to help someone else in their life who's struggling with depression, then that's really awesome, and it's totally worth it for me to write that article if I help that one person. Uh, I have a story about this, actually. I wrote this article about how to identify these two species of plants, one of which is invasive and damaging to the local ecology. And I posted it on various social media accounts, and it got almost no attention. The data on my website showed that it had only a few views, I shared it on Tumblr, no one liked the post on Tumblr, and I got kind of discouraged, and then I forgot about it. Several weeks later, I was signed on to Tumblr, and I got this notification that someone had reblogged that post. I didn't know how they found it, and they wrote this really long note, and they're like, thank you so much for sharing this guide, I've been trying to identify this plant in my backyard, and I used this guide to identify it, and I found out that it's this invasive plant, and I went and I pulled all of it out from my property. And I was like, wow! And I started thinking about it, and I was like, that's the type of impact I want to have with my work. And that's like a successful article. I don't care if no one else views it other than this one person because it had the result of helping this person to do ecological restoration work, to do something that is going to benefit the ecology in their environment. And that's really awesome, that's what I want to do when I share these articles and share these videos. I don't really care about the view count at all. Like, that means so much more to me than another article that had a hundred views and like five people liked the post and whatever. So. I hope that you can find this kind of liberating and encouraging. Uh, you may, like me, realize when you think about it that you've gotten a little bit caught up in this numerical data. And I know with myself I have to keep catching myself and keep saying, no, that's not what matters. So I hope this video can be that kind of reinforcement or encouragement to you. What matters? Quality connections with people, impacting people's lives positively, getting things done in the world, these are the things that matter, and these analytics can be dangerously distracting from that. So I hope this is inspirational. Uh, I'd love to hear from you if you have anything to say. Uh, thank you.